What's going on everybody? Welcome to Charge It Up. For today's video, we're gonna be doing autopilot on the highway. Let's go. All right guys, so for today's video, it's gonna be autopilot on the highway going from Mississauga to Toronto. And we do have a destination on the navigation. So I'm just gonna go navigate on autopilot. So I'll do everything on its own here. And immediately it's trying to tell me to go into this lane, that this lane is slow and it wants me to go into this lane. However, there's a car right there. So once that car is gone, the car will automatically change lanes. There it is. And then we'll let autopilot do its thing all the way to our destination. Let's go. All right, so right now we are on the Queen Elizabeth Way in Mississauga, Ontario. We are doing 102 kilometers an hour in the far left lane because there is some traffic. We will be going through downtown Toronto today using the Gardiner Expressway, go through downtown Toronto and then we'll continue through our destination. Is it gonna get busy? Maybe, maybe not. We'll see what happens. But one thing I do know for sure, Autopilot is gonna be the driving and taking us to where we wanna go. lane change here just to be in the middle lane and then we're going down to 120 kilometers per hour lane change required here I was asking me to make a lane change and I'll make the lane change probably because we're doing 104 or 100 yeah I think it was 105 106 and it wants to be doing quicker because I do have the max speed limits at 120 I'm going to make an upcoming lane change here, so I will make the lane change right now. So we are right now on the Gardner Expressway eastbound still. And because there is construction going on, the lanes are actually pretty small here. So you can see how close the border is. We're gonna let autopilot continue its thing here. Let's speed up to, I was at 100, we'll speed up to 105. And then as you can see, we'll be merging onto the Don Valley Parkway in just a little bit here. I'm keep an eye out here for this turn because the border is super close. I'll take over there just because I wasn't sure if it was gonna make that turn exactly. Although I'm pretty sure I have a video on here, I'll just make a lane change here during a, during a turn of me actually making that turn. Um, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm actually doing faster than 105 too, so um, maybe because I was a little paranoid about it, but regardless. <laughs> Better safe than sorry. And obviously with full, full self-driving coming out soon, uh, I'll have more confidence in that at that point, so. All right, we are now on the Don Valley Parkway. It is a maximum 90 highway, so we are at 105. We're just gonna take it easy here, go down DVP, let autopilot do its thing. to make the lane change so I'll make the lane change into 
interesting. It's asking me to make another lane change here. Not sure why. So we have 4.2 kilometers left until we do make the transition from DVP to 401. And it wants me to make the lane change here. However, this is obviously busier. This lane is obviously busier. We also have cars coming on to this lane from I'm going to actually have to cancel that for now. That's a little odd that it's asking me to make the lane change even though this lane is faster. And that we still have 3.4 kilometers to go until we get anywhere near the change of the highway. And now we'll make the lane change that Autopilot wants me to make. This is an on-ramp right here, but it actually does turn into a lane just going straight. This guy is just going to decide to cut me off because he just felt like it, I guess. Now it wants me to make a lane change here, so I'll do so. I guess it doesn't want me to go on the express. It wants me to stay on collectors here for 401. System slowed down quite a bit here. I'm curious to see how it does this turn. Slow it down here to 60 to make this turn. Alright, so that was alright. We are now on Highway 401 eastbound in Toronto. We are doing 125 kilometers on 401. And we are 7 minutes from our destination. Now we will go into the lane it wants me to go into. So right now, now we are stuck behind this car or the truck. I'm actually going back into this lane because we're we'd be stuck behind this guy doing around 90. And obviously I understand what autopilot wants, it wants me to get into that lane because it doesn't want me to do it last minute. And we will get into that lane just as soon as we get to this area right here. Still wants me to make the lane change, which obviously I would, but now there's traffic coming. Actually. Nah, I'm not going to keep it. This guy not even in his lane there, so that's nice. Alright, and now that we're past that guy, I will make the lane change. That guy does not know where his trailer is. He's in the other lane. It's ridiculous. Make the signal and then stay in this lane. Nicely done. Slowing down for the off ramp. Nicely done. Alright, guys, that's it for today's video. Hope you enjoyed it. Hit that like button if you did. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And hit that notification bell on future videos about the Model X. Until the next one, guys.